Hi everyone. This video will demonstrate logging in to uh, the SI2016 client. Now, uh, the first time you go to log in, um, you're going to be prompted to enter your username, your password, um, and the name or IP address of your server. Now, uh, if you change the port during installation, um, you'd want to change that, but this will default to 9010. Uh, which most users end up using, just so you know. But to get this information, um, whoever sets you up as a user uh, may have sent you an email. If not, you can ask them to send you an email directly through uh, the interface. When they log in and go to manage users, they can select your user and uh, shoot you an email with your username, password, um, and server name. It'll look something like this. Get username, password, server name, uh, server IP address. So uh, it's up to you which one you want to use. And uh, of course, the service port there, in this case, the default being 9010. So just enter that information and you will be logged into the SI2016 client. And if you want to, you can click the uh, Remember Me option, and then you will also have the option to connect automatically so you um, won't have to see the screen and click the connect button each time. So we'll go ahead and do that, click connect, and uh, this will log you into the SI2016 client and you'll have uh, full functionality of the software.